I don't want to be judgmental. She might have some issues. Fact of warrants for Damn. failure to pay child support. Why would I hope you don't think this girlfriend would take this case for you? Oh my Jesus. On 219 and 533 grams of. Yo! What's going on, G-Dot family? It's your boy, G-Dot TZ, back with another VZ, man. Let's go ahead and get straight back into it. We got that water, that water, water, up for the grave. You know what I'm saying? If you don't know what that is, that's that Pee Wee Longway. I want you to go ahead and type that in and listen to that real quick. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We, we fuck with the Atlanta trap niggas over here, but let's go ahead and get into the drug dealer's worst nightmare. Becomes a reality. I don't, there's a lot of shit that could go wrong for a drug dealer that he would want to go right. So we finna go ahead and see what they think of that. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. Also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, GuaboyG. And Twitter, GuaboyG. Go ahead and get straight into it, man. Let's see what's going on. Yeah. You can't forget, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you might not be the, you know what I'm saying? I got the biggest sword in the fight. But nigga, I got a dagger, you feel me? Huh? And the dagger still gets the job done. 2022. Officers pulled over a white Dodge Charger due to a broken headlight in Palm Coast, Florida at around 1 in the morning. Okay. Here's what happened next. Okay. Hello, how you doing? Good, how are you? Good, hey, I'm Deputy Cassette Fly County Sheriff, so I was gonna stop, you got a headlight out. I know, somebody, when I was at work, okay. I just got off of work. <laughs> no worries, listen, I, I don't know if you, you know, unfortunately. I don't want to be judgmental. I, don't, I would hate for people to be judgmental to me. But I'm giving my first impressions of what I'm seeing right now. And it's looking like... She might have some issues. Really, that's the only way I can tell you. So that's yeah, why I can say it. She might. She might. I, it she might have some issues. I was at work, so I did put something yeah. up there, so I did have a light. No worries. Like I said, I, okay. I just stopped someone, and they had no idea. Okay. So. Okay. Um, like no, I said, no, I knew. All right. Let me see your license, registration, insurance, real quick. Okay. I just bought this car. No worries. So it did okay. Buy it's who? Um, Eric Rowland. Okay. I just bought the car. Okay. Sure. No okay. Any sure. crack, cocaine, hemp, LSD, marijuana in the car? That's it. Medical marijuana card. Either one of you. Okay. When's the last time you smoked? Oh, me? Yeah. About an hour ago. Okay. In the car? No, it Bro. And you gotta be a different type of dumb ass nigga for the police to ask you some shit and you say you answer honestly. Especially like, you, when, when was the last time you smoked? An hour ago. Nigga, so you admitting to doing crack? That's what you're doing. In front of the police. So now they have a reason. You niggas be so slow. No, I just got off work. <laughs> so do you have any on you right now? Me, I don't have nothing. So where's the smell coming from? Is it just from you earlier? It's on my clothes. Yeah. I just I, I work at Inverter. Oh. I just came to pick him up from our. Uh, yeah, but no, I still got the, got the car. Work, um, one of the I guess one of the kids hit my car. That's fine. So I just put it on. Yeah. No worries. Like I said, we're just gonna. If it's just that, get your, get your warning, you're out of here. Yeah, thank you. Are there any blunts or anything like that in the car? No, sir. Okay. No, sir. So obvious. They want some more. I work for Ember. <laughs> they want some more. No, like yeah. I said, there's just things that I ask once we get there that we yeah, just start no, going you're through. You're fine. I'm just, I'm tired. You're good. They're trying to search that car. Any longer than we need to. Thank They're trying you. to get y'all out that car. They ain't no, no play. No. Uh, Eric Rowland. It's my son's father. There's that back. Shortly after running her information, deputies began a search on the vehicle as they had probable cause due to the odor of marijuana. They put him in handcuffs. So that's the man crazy. In the vehicle was discovered to have active warrants for Damn. failure to pay child support and for failure to pay child support is the craziest warrant to have, nigga. You just going to jail for not being a good father. What type of crazy ass shit is that, man? Pay your child support, kid, man. I'm saying, I'm saying even if it's going to your BM, man, at least may do it. You got to do it because if you don't do it, you're gonna get a felony. You ain't gonna look bad. So just do it, man. God damn, y'all be trying to, I ain't gonna pay my BM, I ain't gonna do this. I mean, now he's going to jail looking stupid. Violating his probation in a cocaine possession case. Wow. So you got one for probation violation and uh, child support. So but once I know more, I'll let you know. Did you know you had those? No, what for violation? Violation. Child support. Oh, just All right, man, so, yeah, you got warrants. What we got to do now is wait. They got to send a, a message to those counties and confirm that they're still active and stuff. And then if they are, take it out. That's crazy. That's probably the craziest way ever. You gotta wait to see if they still wanna charge you. Niggas gotta think about it. Do I still wanna charge this nigga? Do I still want him to go to jail? Stand up for me. Just stand up. 
Turn around. You're not under arrest. You're just gonna be detained, okay? Yeah. Face the car for me, bro. You got anything on you to post stick me or hurt me? Yeah. Where at? One of these parts. I don't know. Uh, which one. Right now, your medical card's not valid. So what yeah. I'm gonna tell you right now is, if you have any weed like shoved or tucked, yeah. if you take it in there, it's a felony. If you tell me out here, it's a misdemeanor. I don't have nothing. No worries. You got your pants open. Anything up in here? Open it. You can look yourself. Listen, I'm, listen, man. Before I start digging on your on your junk and everything, go I ahead, dude. Go ahead. Shine light for me. Go ahead. No, that's probably the worst job in the world. He ain't trying it. Yeah. No, uh, so, I can be listen, police. There's nothing in my back seat. I check it before shift every day. If I find anything on the ground, seat, or anything around there, you will be connected to it because I know there's nothing back there, okay? So I'm gonna walk you back over there. We're gonna have a seat, okay? How long did you say you smoked? Because you like definitely reek right now. Like an hour ago? Just weed? Okay. I'm gonna turn the air up and all that so you get air and stuff, okay? I don't know what you're talking about, officer. What the hell is that? How y'all got the shit in the car? And you know you got a warrant and you still riding around. And you, t and you still got it in the car, man. What, what, why are you so stupid? Why do you, why do you do stupid ass shit, man? Why would you do that? This is... And then you trying to act like you know this girl ain't going to take this case for you. Why would I hope you don't think this girl's going to take this case for you, boy? You're going to jail, bucko. Oh my Jesus! Here's the weed we were looking for. Huh? That shit wasn't even wrapped right. Something I'm gonna notate is there's a in this bag there's a box with his name on these cards. Is that where you find all that? So far everything's been out of this bag. Yes. Oh, they charging him anyway, so he didn't even get a chance to do it. Damn. No, this has all been from the bag. No, this is for hers. No, it's not registered to her. She told me she just bought it. Yeah, she said it was to she said it was to her son's husband or her husband's son or son's father or some. They don't even know. They don't care about Kristen. that. Kristen, I'm Deputy Hill. Listen, okay. So there's some stuff in the car that I want to ask a couple questions about because you're detained because you're in handcuffs. So I have to advise you if you're Miranda warning. Okay. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say may be used as evidence against you. You have the right to talk to an attorney and have him or her present with you now or during time during questioning. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed to represent you. If okay. at any time you wish to stop talking or have an attorney present, all questioning will be stopped at your request. Do you understand your rights? All right. With these rights in mind, do you want to talk to me? Yeah, I mean, that's my car. I just got home from work. That book bag is not mine. I literally just picked him up down the street. Okay. So, so this is do, you, do you want to talk to me? That's what I'm saying. Talk to me about this. Five of each 21 hour check. What? I'm saying it's not mine. I'm just letting you know that's my car. I just picked him up. Is there going to be anything on you and you, anything like that? Yes, this was the last time you used? It's been years. Years? Yes. So you just randomly pick up this guy? That's my ex-boyfriend. That's your ex-boyfriend? Yes, sir. Where'd you pick him up at? Um, just right down the street. I was at work. And where, where did you... I told you. I'm just nodding my head because I told you, nigga. I told you, nigga. I told you she was going to snitch on you. You thought this white woman was going to keep your black ass safe? You thought this woman... No, she's not taking that dumbass charge for your stupid ass, boy. She just might get a little charge just for like, I don't mean, I maybe knowing. You do know what I'm saying? But you're taking a chunk. You're taking a chunk, bro. You're going down for that shit. You're getting some years. You already had some warrants and they got child support. So there ain't no good angle you can paint. You're going down. Child support just made that shit worse. Did you pick him up? You said down the road. Yeah, Where's right there. Um, Pleasant. Pleasant? Yeah, Pleasant. Was he at a house or was he walking? Uh, He was walking down the street. He was at a house. The GPS. Where were you taking him now? Uh, back to Daytona. Back to Daytona? Is he living in Daytona? I, like I said, I haven't, I haven't, I haven't talked to him. Like, he lives in Orlando. So, so why go pick him up today? Because it sounded like he was like in trouble, like he was arguing with somebody. So he was like, plus, I have six minutes. He said, he said, I'll give you $50 if you can come get me right now. Okay. And of course, I just bought that car, and I don't get paid for the car That's your car? Yes, I just bought it from my son's father. So that car's yours, you picked him up, and that backpack's his. Yes, sir. You've never touched that backpack. Yes, sir. So we DNA tested, it's never gonna be, nothing on it's gonna be yours. What about the powder that's in the back seat? He, like, literally, he, I pulled up, put something, I didn't even know what he put in the back seat, because it's dark. Okay, you have a text message from him saying to come yeah. pick him up for $50? Yes, sir. Okay, you say anything else? Yeah. Nothing else? Nothing about no drugs or anything. No? No, sir. Okay. She won't be good. Sure she snitched the phone just to confirm that he asked you to come pick him up. Yeah, here. that's fine. I that's fine. I, yeah, I can show you. Okay. Was yours? Mm-hmm. Get the pink button. 
go to them text messages. See? That's crazy. Can I look at it real quick? Oh, hi. Can you come get me if I pay you three dollars? What's the address? 76 Providence Lane. I'm all way now. Thank you. That's and crazy. Message. And he's Adrian Rivers. Yeah. Yep, it's over with, boy. Yo ass. Oh my god. Did we test the weed? Pop it open. She ain't gonna ride for you. She ain't She's gonna die for you. Goof ass nigga. Oh. oh, yeah. Weed? Yeah. Can confirm. After the full search, the cops found 219 grams of fentanyl and 533 grams of marijuana. Police oh say God. Mr. Rivers' criminal history dates more than 30 years back, all the way from 1988 for crimes such as grand theft auto, forgery, selling cocaine, burglary, and much more. However, with this incident, he was charged with two felony counts of trafficking fentanyl and possession of marijuana with intent to sell and is oh being held on a bond. Don't forget to like, comment. Bro, god damn, bro. She ain't get charged with shit. You took all that. You took the L. The shit was in your bag. The shit was in, had name tags in your bag. It was just... Nigga, you probably ain't getting out. I ain't gonna lie. You probably got a cool 20 ball. They don't play about them drugs, boy. You better off catching a body than doing shit. You got that fit. Phew. About 20. About cool 20.